I would like freaking scream if I tried to loot one of these soldiers and then it told me insufficient skill. <laughs> of course you'd have to try to get that That's armor insane. off to get in there, I suppose. This the Garrick I know what you are. It won't work. I will stay strong. Are you alright? The boy is exhausted. And this cage, uh, I've never seen anything like it. Rest easy. Help is here. Uh, enough visions! If anything in you is human, uh, kill me now and stop this game. You broke the others, but I will stay strong for my sake. For theirs. Filthy blood mages getting in my head. Ah, uh, I will not break. I'd rather die. Oh, I don't know which. I'd love to say all of them, really. <laughs> You're not going to, da to die, not if I can help it. Silence! I'll not listen to anything you say. Now be gone! Still here. But that's always worked before. I close my eyes, but you are still here when I open them. I'm real, and I'm here to help you. Don't blame me for being cautious. The voices, the, the images, so real. Did Gregor send you? How? How did you get here? Rigor sent me, in a sense. Good. Kill Aldred. Kill them all for what they've done. They cased us like animals. Looked for ways to break us. I'm the only one left. They turned some into monsters and oh, there was nothing I could do. Where are Irving and the other mages? What others? What are you talking about? Irving and the other mages who fought Aldred. Where are they? They are in the harrowing chamber. The sounds coming up from there. Oh, Omega. We must hurry. They are in grave danger. I am sure of it. You can't save them. You don't know what they've become. We can't just kill them all. They've been surrounded by, by blood mages whose wicked fingers snake into your mind and corrupt your thoughts. His hatred of mages is so intense. The memory of his friend's deaths is still fresh in his mind. You have to end it now, before it's too late. I want to save everyone who can possibly be saved. Are you really saving anyone by taking this risk? To ensure this horror is ended. To guarantee that no abominations or blood mages live. You must kill everyone up there. I cannot decide on that before seeing what's going on. That is your choice to make, but I beg you to consider what I have to say. You cannot tell Maleficarum by sight. Just one could influence the mind of a king, of a grand cleric. I do not want the blood of innocence on my hands. I am just willing to see the painful truth, which you are content to ignore. Ah, but what can I do? As you can see, I am in no position to directly influence your actions, though I would love to deal with the mages myself. We will deal with you once Aldred lies dead. My cage is Aldred's doing, or one of his mages. Once they're dead, I will be free. Stay safe, it will be over soon. 
No one ever listens. Not until it's far too late. Make her turn his gaze on you. I hope your compassion hasn't doomed us all. Alright. Now, my first time doing this, you're gonna we have to use the litany. Well, it's not have to. I beat him without the litany. It was a bit of a bitch to do, but um It's yeah, it's doable. I didn't realize how to use it at first. I take it you're Aldred. Oh, very observant. I'm quite impressed you're still alive. Unfortunately, that must mean you killed my servants. Ah, oh, well, they are probably better off dying in the service of their betters than living with the terrible responsibility of independence. He has such a creepy voice. <laughs> I'm sorry, are you upset I killed your lackeys? We needn't fixate on who killed whom. That doesn't help our relationship. There's no relationship to speak of. You're an abomination. A mage is but the larval form of something greater. Your gentry vilifies us, calls us abomination when we have truly reached our full potential. Look at them. The Chantry has them convinced. They deny themselves the pleasure of becoming something glorious. You're mad. There's nothing glorious about what you've become, Aldred. <laughs> Aldred? He is gone. I am Aldred, and yet not Aldred. I am more than he was. I could give you this gift win. You and all the mages. It would be so much easier if you just accepted it. But some people can be so stubborn. Apparently, if I just ignore my dad knocking at my door, he'll go away. It's awesome. <laughs> anyway, um, I would have normally answered, but not in the middle of a cutscene. <laughs> 